Hey guys, what's up? It's St. Patrick's Day tomorrow and I know what you're thinking. We need to wear test some green lipsticks, some office appropriate slaying greens. So I had the Bite Beauty Kale lipstick in my cart for ages and ages and ages, just could not commit to the green. And then I heard about the Sephora Lip Stories line coming out and I kind of watched some people talk about the beautiful nudes and the pinks. And they have so many incredible colors in that range. So I thought, why not take a risk and try out the green color? It's only $10 Canadian. So they actually have 40 colors. Most of them are beautiful reds, pinks, berry colors. They have cream finishes, matte finishes, and metal finishes. It is the cream color in cash money, hashtag lip stories. This product is made in Italy and you get four grams of product. The packaging is just a cardboard tube, which is kind of cool, especially because they did such a giant line. It looks like they're really being not wasteful. The packaging is cool on all of the products. They all have a different little photo, which I absolutely love. Um, the tube is a little bit flimsy, which makes me a little bit nervous because I am quite rough, especially if I like throw a color in my purse. I can't guarantee that it's not gonna get squished. And it comes with a pink plastic tube, and here's the beautiful green bullet. It even says hashtag cream on the bullet there. So let's get this on and wear test it for the next 12 hours. Mm, okay, it's very opaque. It has a slight scent, it's got a beautiful shiny texture to it, and it is a gorgeous color. Let me just blot it because I'm gonna really try to wear this all day and I really kind of want it to stain it down on my lips. Um, I don't know, blotting seems to take off a lot, a lot of the color and a lot of that darkness, so. I like the bullet shape a lot. It's a great shape for getting my lip shape down. All right, so far I think for 10 bucks, this looks really nice. Super shiny, a very creamy finish. It feels very creamy, kind of slippery on the lips, so hopefully we don't get too much feathering or anything. But yeah, super fun, super happy so far. So let's see how it does over the course of today. Here we go. I feel like it's dried down now. This is the color I think that you're going to get most of the time once you're wearing it. Kind of got a perfumey, gross smell. Taste. Okay, let's keep going. All right guys, it's the end of the night and this is what my lips are looking like. And this is what they honestly look like for most of the day. It really didn't wear especially well. I found during this last couple of hours when I was like at work and trying to look really presentable, I ended up applying, reapplying the lipstick like every 15 minutes going back to check to make sure it looks decent. It just does not last well by itself. Even if you attempt to blot it or powder it down, it just does not deposit a stain and it's really super high maintenance. So if you are wearing it for a short amount of time or you're getting it for Halloween or a photo shoot, then I think that's absolutely fine. Go for it. But if you think this is like your one all day wear green little lipstick in your collection, this, this isn't the one. This would get, I think, a two out of five for me. It's just way too high maintenance. It just does not wanna stay where it's put. And when it fades down, it just looks patchy and kind of gross and not flattering. I hope that helped you get a better idea of the performance of Cash Money or some of the other more bold 
cream finish lip story lipsticks let me know if you've tried any of these lip story lipsticks if you have a green lipstick that you would recommend to me that's gonna last all day maybe a liquid lipstick definitely leave it down in the comments below so I can check it out like should I look at kale I don't know if I like want to invest my time and money into finding a really great green lipstick like I feel like I have a really nice black and a really nice dark blue and some really nice dark browns and reds but I don't know if I can like justify the green but anyway, hope you guys have a great St. Patrick's weekend. Hope you guys rock out with your bold lipstick. Huge thank you, of course, to my patrons for helping me bring these videos to you guys. Aside from that, guys, I will see you all in Monday's video. Bye!